Psalm 30. I will exalt you, Lord, for you rescue me. You refuse to let my enemies triumph over me. O oh Lord my God, I cried to you for help and you restored my health. You brought me up from the grave. O oh Lord, you kept me from falling into the pit of death. Sing to the Lord, all you godly ones. Praise his holy name, for his anger lasts only a moment, but his favour lasts a lifetime. Weeping may last through the night, but joy comes with the morning. When I was prosperous, I said, nothing can stop me now. Your favour, O Lord, made me as secure as a mountain. Then you turned away from me and I was shattered. You know, the psalmist talks about this situation where, in some ways, he is so confident and strong and, um, you know, and those moments when we're feeling triumphant, when we're feeling like everything's fantastic and it's going great. Um, well, those times are easier, aren't they? But what about the times when it's not going that way and everything's changed and, you know, we feel like, are we under the anger of God? Are we, are we away from him? Has he turned his face away from us? Well, what's going on? Um, we're confused. We don't understand what's happening. And, you know, God wants to remind us through this psalm that in the times which are going great and in the times which are not going so well, God is still faithful to us. He's still on the throne. He's still working with us. He's still dealing with stuff with us. And he's still taking us through. And, you know, we can have really tough times, but he can take us through to the other side. Um, so, Father, I want to pray today for anybody who's struggling, who's uh moments have been like that night time where they've been confused with where things are going and they don't see the dawn yet and they're wondering um whether god is still with them in the middle of the dark places and i want to pray that lord as you say here in verse 11 you've turned my mourning into joyful dancing you've taken away my clothes of mourning clothed me with joy where people fill their clothes with all the negative rubbish Remove that, give them a fresh hope and, and a freedom to see that you're still in control despite all the circumstances. You're bigger than them, you're stronger. Help them to throw off all the grave clothes that have been holding them down in the midst of this dark season. And I pray that that will be the reality for you as well, that God will do that in your life too.